strange square clouds forming worldwide and nobody knows why. Uh, we have an image here from the ISS. Swathes of perfect squares and uh, here in this image you see one on the right and one on the left. We don't even know how that's possible. This is on uh, bended reality from uh, people that cannot explain these strange occurrences. More people are starting to see these and record them and they start saying that these are an undiscovered type of cloud that it's been there but uh, nobody really has noticed it up to now and so for all these years gone by no one would have seen them that's very strange it's not usual it's incredible and it seems totally wrong cloud should not look like a square because of the fact that it's supposed to be water vapor that's being whisked around by the air and the wind the breezes such clouds that begin appearing all over the, our planet in recent years are constantly increasing. What are they? That they're, why are they so perfectly square? What are the reasons for these strange clouds? And what's behind the strange weather that we've been having? Can nature really create clouds in the form of a perfect square with right angles? We're not talking about stars or rectangles or circles or hearts. We're talking about rectangles and squares, mystery clouds. The squares over Devon, UK. And uh, why is that? Is this weather engineering? Is this geoengineering? Weather control? What is this exactly? Is there someone on Earth who can shape clouds like this? What kind of technology could do this? Can we control rain? Well, we have been controlling rain and hail and lightning uh, for quite some decades now. But why are they doing this? What's behind all these square clouds, rectangular clouds? We don't have the information yet. All leading countries of the world categorically deny use of climate control technologies. So what's the explanation for all of this? If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece. In Kapota, and we also help 
the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.